Hello guys, welcome back to another video on the Traders Hunt series. And I'm Success Obuna, your host on this Traders journey, guys. It's been an exciting journey with you all this year, right? We started just in January. I think January 2nd or so we started this channel, and here we are, right? Back to been hitting, shooting, and creating, giving amazing video content to you guys back to back, back to back, all through this year, up to Today, right up to today that I'm shooting this video, which actually would be the of, which is officially the last day I'll be shooting the video in 2022 on the Traders Hunt series, right? Although I'll be shooting uh, a couple of videos, just a, a couple of educational videos for you guys, but not review my chart because this to tell you guys that officially I am out of the market for the year, guys. I'm out of the market for the year. I will just spend. I'll be spending more of my time. Uh, reviewing uh, some assets, doing investing my time on research, planning for the new year, guys. That's been an amazing journey with you guys, been, and, and that is why today I'm gonna be preparing your minds right on the market. What the market is actually preparing, cooking up for us in 2023, and I'm so excited to be shooting this video. And if you are just watching my videos for the very first time, you're yet to sign up, subscribe to this channel. You're yet to subscribe to this channel, or even like comment share share my videos you are so wrong guys you are so so wrong wrong so ensure if you know anybody because guys what should be, i'm cooking for you guys next year you guys aren't ready you guys aren't ready yet trust me guys you guys aren't ready because next year is gonna be blast it's full of blast it's full of awesomeness and myself and my team are busy we are in the kitchen <laughs> guys we are in the kitchen when i say we're in the kitchen i really really mean it guys we're in the kitchen cooking some crazy crazy sumptuous meal because i could feel the aroma okay trust me guys i could feel the aroma from here right now talking to you guys and i and I'm, I'm so sure you guys aren't ready for what's hitting you guys on this channel and if you're here to share my videos with any trader you know any struggling trader or any newbie trader you know you are so wrong stop hiding my videos guys stop hiding my videos stop hiding my videos share this video with every trader you know everybody on your channels and all trust me guys we at the end of the day we all we all should win right the, the idea of the idea my idea of coming out here to shoot my crate show you guys my charge show you guys how to make money from the forex or crypto market is because i just want everybody to win and so i advise you guys to also do the same right let's all grow this channel together right but then guys i'm so so super grateful to you all that have been following me from january up to this very moment and in january i started with zero subscribers today i'm over a hundred subscribers although that is not actually this wasn't actually my target my target was actually hit a thousand over a thousand subscribers but then at least it, like in english like in, in nigeria yeah we say at all at all nine beta pass <laughs> at all at all nine beta pass but then guys please i right, just grow this channel together because it doesn't make sense when all these valuable all these valuable contents i share with you guys are not being uh, seen or viewed by a lot of people out there were been losing money some of them were actually giving up on the market some of them were almost contemplating suicide because of the amount of money they've lost from the forex market when they could have access to these videos and make good money from themselves just like you i know you guys have been making money from just look, watching my, my charts see my seeing how i re do my stuff here as i do it guys so please I would encourage us, I just may encourage you us, let's not slack in sharing this video, let's not slack in making this channel go better because I know I'm doing super, super amazing stuff for you guys. And trust me, guys, if you think this year was great for us, watch out what we'll be, good, what we'll be doing next year, guys. Trust me, guys, just watch out what we'll be doing next year, watch out what we'll be doing next year, right? Because in, uh, next year is gonna be. A bomb i keep saying it guys it's gonna be a bomb a bomb a bomb a bomb and bomb and if you are still yet to share my video this share my the, the link to my videos please ensure you do so i'll be dropping the link to this channel on the description section where you can get to see it and also very importantly right before going for christmas break while going for a christmas break, break and you are yet to, to sign up for the forex mastery program guys i'll be opening it up again in january do yourself good right don't just enough of all that gambling all that struggling all that losing streaks all that uh failed uh blown accounts let me just use the word right enough of you blowing accounts 2023 is gonna be a very crazy year 
right? It's going to be a very tough year, and you can't afford to go into enter 2023 looking the way you look right now, with the same kind of trading approach you have right now, with the same repeated struggling, uh, losing, blowing account every now and then, keep your gold is depositing but never withdrawing from the market. It also makes sense, right? So ensure you do save this gold, guys. Do yourself this good by investing on your education, by taking up the Forex Mastery Program. And the link is down from the description section. Send me a message as sub. Guys, send me a message as sub requesting access to the Forex Mastery Program or the Crypto Mastery Program because next year is going to be so, 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 so loud and you can't afford to be left behind in, on all the amazing and all the good next that 2023 has in store for all of us. Right? So I don't want you to miss out on all the goodness and all the amazing opportunities in next year, right? So put an end to put an end to losing 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 money consistently in the market, dashing the broadcast money, ensure to sign up for the Forex Mastery program. Or if you're into crypto and you're looking at to be profitable in the crypto market or doing research in the crypto space, spotting hots and rare gems that will do give you 100 x 1000 x and all that sign up for the crypto master program because here guys the crypto master program i know i don't exactly talk about it like i should but it is a complete course that takes you from beginners just like the forest master program i see guys when i create a course when i create a program i give everything i put in everything i put in everything that is needed that is required of of you to be a pro in that space even even if you are if you never ever ever had done it with crypto before one thing I'm certain is by the end of the crypto program, you will be an early to be an expert. That's one thing I, I'm, I'm guaranteeing you guys. Uh, by the end of the crypto of the Forest Master program, you'll be the best, one of the best amongst your mates, amongst your peers in the space. No jokes. That's because I know what I I know what I know and I know what I have cooked for you guys. Right? So guys, in the GP, I'll be showing you guys my chat in the GP and I'll be showing you guys what the what uh the market is preparing for all of us in 2023 and how we can position yourself guys on what the market has in store for us so guys then i'll be showing you guys uh my screen right in the gv so the next thing you'll be seeing will be my screen so stay built and stay glued to this video so don't go anywhere hello guys welcome back to my screen so today's video is a very very important video right you can't afford not to pay attention to everything i'll be saying here on my screen right because i'll be i'm preparing us for what to expect or what opportunities the market has in store for us in 2023 so guys i'll be showing you what exact my exact projection and i'll be on the market generally for the new year, at least for the first three months, for the first three months or four months in 2023, what you should be expecting from the market, right? What you should be expecting from the market. So this is me looking at the X Y from the monthly time frame, right? And from the monthly time frame, which is a very important time frame for me. If some of you have been following me for months now, you know that these higher time frames I don't choke with them because this is where institutions position themselves this is where institutions go to all to deal with a lot of day traders and scalpers right so because the overall these guys give you an overall picture an overall view and they'll give you and also constitute the major trend of the market so every trend you are seeing in the lower time frame is 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 a it's a function of all that is go on on, on all the higher time frames are seeing Right, and one thing, one thing about the higher time frame is that their language is consistent. So the higher time, the monthly time frame, weekly time frame, day time, they are always speaking the same language. It's up to you to be able to align yourself to understand the languages and, and these languages and how you are able to, why you should be able to interpret them is all I've been able to show you guys in the forex mastery program and I, I will not be showing all that here right now. Right, so if you don't have a copy of the forex mastery program, trust me, you are missing a lot. You are missing a whole lot, right? You're missing a whole lot. And you can't afford to enter 2023 of all times the same way, right? So from here on the X, Y, right, which shows the strength of the US dollar, you can see that we have an evening star, right? The section one of the Forex Master Program is where I've done justice to candlestick patterns and 
also can well, I also have a section for candlestick psychology. I have a video in section in section one of the Forex Master Program where I did justice with candlestick psychology. We'll be able to understand not just because it, it not because it maybe it's a it's a, it's a bullish recovery, a money savings. I know the exact story. That's what that's what I showed you in, in candlestick psychology. The exact story behind these patterns. So what you should be expecting because to do this, this candlestick, uh, this candlestick is the language of the market. They tell you they they tell they interpret the storyline. They have a storyline that's telling. So it's up to you be able to understand this storyline and position yourself according to this story that the market is telling for your own profits. Right. So this is also the monthly time frame. You can see that we have an evening star, guys, and you can see the the BS and. Uh, this evening start being very strong shows you that the bs are really strong on the xy are really really strong on the xy so this means for the for the for the uh next three four months with the next three four months especially and uh, uh in 2023 three four months the xy mind you i'm talking about the xy now, the the us dollar would is expected to be weak the US dollar is expected to be weak in the next, in the first three to four months of the market, right? So th this means this guy would fall maybe up to this point, right? So okay, before I talk about this, you can see that here, for instance, we have a double bottom situation. We have a double bottom situation that the market has, and we've, go we've gone up. So this is more like this support level here is more like the neckline of this double bottom. So it's possible that the price just wants to come down to this neckline. Before shooting back up, but not like since it has broken its test, it wants to test it before shooting back up. Or we could come down back into this consolidation, right? Before possibly shooting, shooting up. Or worst case scenario, this are we could break this guy, possibly retest it before then pull it downwards. You can see all the scenarios that the XY is painting to us. Right? Anything is possible in this space. Anything and everything is possible in this space. So this is possibly what is going to happen. So if this happens, that means we should be expecting that our major peers would be bullish. We should be expecting that our major peers and our major assets with which would be bullish in the market. Right, so so for the at least January, February, March, for instance, at least expected that these three months, this guy will drop in these three months, right? So if it not breaks, if it breaks this neckline, right, this is the point where possibly personally I'll be giving it as my own automaton. I don't see breaking this soon, right? This is at this this is like my worst case scenario at ninety, right? The DX were trading at ninety dollar. This is like the worst case scenario for me, right? Before we possibly shoot back up. So this is what my this is my position on the XY, and I advise you guys to trade accordingly. So the XY for the multi time frame is bleeding, is dropping. So if you go to the weekly time frame, you see that this guy is still very much dropping. The BS momentum of the BS is still very much strong. Right, so if you go to the daily time frame, so you can see that I've naked this market, right? I've naked this chart, so I need to bring back some of the things we removed. All right, from the daily time frame, maybe you want to reanalyze it as a trader, but I'm not interested in this right now because I am done for the year, I have my target for the year done, right? And I have my investors to smile. So, guys, uh you can see the market is currently strong, very much bearish. The XY, let me maybe if I pick if I pick this from here. Go to the four hour time frame. You see that this guy is still very much bearish. Right? It's very much bearish, just consolidating. And this is December. See, day traders, I have to warn you guys. Because I'm tired of you people coming to my DM to complain about your accounts being blown. Day traders, please learn to take the book, learn to do what institutions are doing. Some of them are already going for breaks already. 
So the, and that is why you can see how the market is just misbehaving. I don't like the way it looks at into the forward time frame. Two, uh, one uh, daily time frame is better for me. Now, I look at the market from this higher time frame, doesn't mean I enter the market on this higher time frame. So I will say this. I do not look at this market from the daily time frame I go on, and I say I want to go and sell here. No. But I only look at all this to know and to see and to set my projection on the market so before going to the lower time frames to execute. The forex markets understand better what I'm saying, right? So this guy is still bearish till he touches this neckline, right? At certainly it's gonna be falling. Fed is gonna be dropping down up to this neckline, right? So these are about the XY. So the next dude that we're looking, looking at now right now will be okay. Let me look at Euro USD. Euro USD from the monthly time frame, right? Euro USD from the monthly time frame, right? Now from the monthly time frame, Euro USD is Euro USD is perfectly set as you can see it. Euro USD is perfectly set for us. It's perfectly set for us as you can see. Although yeah, so uh, because the X Y, which you know is one of the one one dude I love to use as my in my indicator, right? I use it as an indicator to project the market. So I am because of the momentum of the bearish momentum of the X Y, we're gonna we are certain that this guy is gonna really break above this guy and keep going bullish, right? At least for the meantime, because clearly if, if we were to look this clearly this is more like a, a morning star, right? This is clearly a morning star, although we are resting on a major zone in the market. But this is clearly a, a morning star, and this morning star definitely is going to be breaking. Right? It means that we actually should be having more bullish candles building up. Right? You should have more bullish candles building up in the coming months because this is a morning star into, into introducing or initiating the bulls into the market. Right? Initiating the bulls into the market. So um, this is a strong money star. This is a very strong money star, as we can see. This is a very strong money. You can see the strong bullish candle, strong bullish candle, showing the momentum of the buyers in the market. So if you are still going to lower time frames to project selling positions, I don't know what you're selling, but this guy right now is not ready to. It's not looking like a market that wants to sell. It's a bullish market, right? But then we are having a. Uh, Price has not exactly broken this major zone, right? You must, we must be clear on that, on this fact. The price is currently resting on this major zone, right? So anything can still happen, right? That's why, this is why in the market, you, you, you must learn to create room for eventualities, right? For, for eventualities, and so as you can see from the monthly time frame, we have this bullish build up already. And uh, okay, looking at this also from the weekly time frame, as right, you can see that we have since we have not been able to act exactly break out of this major zone, you can see how price is still expressing a form of uh, rejection, right, from uh, on this major zone because in a way that are sell because there have been sellers there, there have been sellers there. So there's this contention but then because the monthly time frame has already told giving us that specific direction invites on the bullish run right the monthly time time frame has given us that invite on a bullish run so we personally have want to uh follow through with that run if although despite the fact that although the major trend is still bearish right on the egg on euro usd the major trend is still very much bearish, as you can see. Very much bearish. We are very much bearish on the on Euro USD. Very much bearish. So, opening the coming weeks, the coming weeks, we should, we should be seeing price actually breaking out of this major zone, right? Properly breaking out of this major zone to show us that truly the the bulls are set to ride the market, right? That truly the bulls are set to ride the market. So. I, I won't, don't, uh, uh, personally, I've closed for the year. I'm not going to get ready. I'm not going to get the market in this, for this period. So I'll just be waiting to see how the market builds and forms. So hopefully in January, when I come to shoot the next video on the Trader's One series, 
would have a clearer picture. I will give you guys a clearer picture of the market because by then the market would have been set to give us a, a specific direction if it wants to trend upwards or trend continue trending downwards. We will see that by next year, in the, which is in uh, which will be the next episode of the trailers on series. So for the now, you can see because on the major zone there is this consolidation. You can see the consolidation, the contention between buyers and sellers on this major zone whether to continue with a trend or to push price upwards. But then from the extra we know that uh, market is uh, is ready to run. Market is ready to rally. Right? Market is set to rally. Right? Market is set to rally upwards. Rally upwards. Sales in market set to rally upwards. So at least I'm bullish in the market. Where of what is going on right now, I am still very much bullish in the market. Right? I'm still very much bullish in the market. Very much bullish in the market. Because if that is the current momentum of the market, and that is what the market is currently doing. Right, so that's on Euro USD. So similar thing with uh, GBP USD. Right, so from the monthly time frame, looking at GBP USD from the monthly time frame, we could see also clearly that we have this strong bullish invite. Strong bullish invite. But GBP USD is you can say price is currently resting at the major zone. It's we're just sitting there. If you check the weekly time frame, we are. It's more like we have broken. So the momentum, if the what about um, uh, GPUs is that it gives you the energy, it shows you the true energy of the market, which where exactly the market is trending or trending. So as you can see, quite the market, even if the overall trend is still is is the overall trend here, while well, it has been broken in our server voice, it has been broken, and you can see that we are already bullish. Right, the actual showing you the exact energy momentum of the market. That market here, uh, guys, market is really bullish. And you can see from the weekly time frame, guys, that the market is just playing around this major zone. Right? So if I were to trade this guy, for instance, if I were, which I'm not, right? This would be like my, I might take this guy here. This, okay, I'm not use this green. I might take this guy here, or maybe even this guy itself. This guy here, this guy here, as my cutoff point for bullish invites. Right, as a cutoff, as a mat, as a cutoff point where I feel that if the bulls break, I know that uh, we are going bullish. We are going bullish. For, I, I, as you can see from the daytime, even from the daily time frame, you can see that we broke, it's looking like a break and a retest, and the market is set to rally up to this major zone. Like you can see how the market is moving from zone to zone. Right? So, hopefully, in the coming weeks, we should be seeing the market set, properly set for the bullish run. So, but in the meantime, we are just around there looking like we are trying to form a uh, a double top, or market wants to bleed a little down. So, you will see a lot of confusion. This is, this is, uh, December, right? So there'll be a lot of there'll be a lot of uh, consolidation, a lot of uh, irregular patterns and movements of the market. This is happening because major investors of the market are taking profit, are exiting the market, are wrapping up for the year, closing for the year, and all that. So that is what is responsible for all this movement. So you don't want to be cut off. You don't want to be. You don't. You won't want to be used as exit liquidity. So the one of the best things you want to do, you don't want to, uh, is not to risk much in the market this period, right? Not to risk much in this market this period because the market is actually, actually wrapping up for a year. Right? So you can see the bullish energy of the markets, the bullish ride of the markets. Because it's making for me higher, higher highs and higher lows, higher high, higher low, higher high. You can see it. Higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high. Some thoughts higher low, and before you know it, we are going. We are good to go. Right? So the market is trending bullish at the moment. And not just at the moment, that's what it's gonna be doing for the main time, at least for a couple of months. We'll be seeing the market trending bullish. Market is gonna be trending bullish for the couple of months. So I would advise you to trade accordingly. I'm 
but relax if possible relax take up take a break from the market guys take a break from the market take, take a chill pill why because you've been trading bling around the market from january come on use this impact to, to relax eat the money spend your money guys right i think i'll be emphasizing on this by the end of this video right so guys um and if at this point you are, you are yet to subscribe to this channel please ensure to do that subscribe to this channel turn on notification and also give this video a thumbs up because i know you are learning a lot already from this video you are seeing a lot already from my from my chat and i know you enjoy you are you, having a good time with the market right so let's look at AUD usd one of my favorite dudes so this is AUD usd from the monthly time frame guys you can see this dude from the monthly time frame you can see how very reactive it is around this major this zone. So if we call this zone again, more like you have a double, it's more like we're having a let me remove this. This is not necessary, right? I think it's not necessary. So you can see it's more like a double bottom, and we have a, a morning star showing us clearly that this guy wants to shoot up at least to this to this to this major zone. The side market moving from zone to zone. If you break this zone, this is the next zone. Right? So we are pleased to be able to learn how to map out these zones. Is what is going to help you stay profitable and winning in the market, right? A bit to learn how to map out these zones in the market, breaking the market into zones, help you contain the market. And once you're able to contain the market, you'll be able to profit from the market, right? So that's what we have been able to do on. Uh, uh, I've been able to do it generally on my assets, being able to contain them by mapping out these zones. Now. You can see from the morning time we also, we also have a money a strong morning star. We have a strong morning star. So you guys I had to rush out to sort something. So uh you can see from the monthly time frame, if the USD is strongly bullish, set to, to set to run to run hell wire, right? So from the weekly time frame, you can see from the weekly time frame we, we can see how the bulls are already building up. Right? You can see how the bulls are already building up on AUD USD. So from the daily time frame, you can see what's going on. Market is just building. So if you are not bullish in the market, trust me, this is the overall. The currently the major the major momentum of the market is bullish. The major momentum of the market for now is strongly strongly bullish. Right, it's strongly bullish, strongly bullish. So I would advise you to trade accordingly. It's just that I'm having a little this zone, this level here. I'll be a little headache. Let me look at it again from the weekly time frame. Mm, I'm spotting something around here. This point here, this point here, this point here, this point here. This point here looks like something worth paying attention to. Uh, this point here looks like something worth paying attention to. Right, because we have been having a lot of uh, there's having a lot of rejection, a lot of um, rejection on the market. So you can see that level is really important. So and that's what we are currently approaching. So at least, definitely, I feel the market is going to break it and continue with the trend because of the momentum, current momentum of the market. We're possibly going to break it and um, continue rallying, but this might give us a little bit of a headache to break. And this zone here might give us a little bit of a headache to break because I feel there are a lot of. Because anyway, you see consolidations or any a, 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 a lot of any zone that we have experienced a lot of touches, but the price actually expressing a lot of bounce shows you that there are a high concentration of other buyers or sellers on that zone. So you want to be careful. If you want to be careful around that zone, so this zone might be it's, it's more like a resistance for me, and this is like 50 percent. Right? That's I think that's okay. Uh, wow, it is actually it is actually 50 percent. Let me just say this for you to you guys. It's more I'm giving you guys this for free. For every time when the market is trending, for every time the market gets to 50 percent between the zones, it's like this is like 50 percent between the zone. If I'm to check out look at this key correctly. It always expresses a form of rejection or a form, a form of uh, retracement. It could be a retracement. It could also be a reversal. 
That is why you have to be pay attention. To, that's why you need to first of all learn how to draw these major zones. I won't draw these major zones. The next thing you need to map out is the fifty percent. Fifty percent between the zone. I mean, the half of the zone. Like from the, from here to here, is hundred percent. So in between is fifty percent. Right? Everything between it is fifty percent. So oftentimes, once players get with fifty percent into the zone, into that major zone, it it, it tends to experience a form of rejection. Or it, tends, it tends to behave in a funny way. So if you've been buying, at least at this point, you don't want to start taking some, you want to take some profit and lock your remaining profits, right? Lock your remaining profit or take some profit because it, we could express a reversal from here. And we could also express, we could we definitely express a form of bounce. So if it's continuous, that would be a reversal. But if it then, if we just, if we recover, that will not be a, 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 a retracement that will take us into the next major zone and we we'll continue our trend into the next major zone so guys this is how i'll be looking at the market right this is how i'm looking at the market right now actually AD usd looks really interesting and if you if you've been buying AD usd be aware of this level this is 0 0.700 right this is 0 0.7000 mark it's a level you want to pay attention to it's a level you want to pay attention to 0 0.700 mark it's a level you want to pay attention to because the price could retrace from that point. It could retrace from that point or reverse from that point. You're going to retrace or reverse from that point, definitely. Right? So you want to be careful, careful in looking at this, the market, or the excitement you get to that level. Right? That is not on, on, that is not on AUD, USD. Right? That is not on AUD. This are, that is not on, my, on my major asset that I trade. And also, I'll be looking at uh, for those of those of us, those of you guys who tweet JPYPS. Let me just give you guys a, a little gift on JPYPS. Well, this is like, like the last video for 2022. So I want to let me give you guys some happy Christmas. So this is JPY basket. Right? This is this is our JPY basket, and you can see clearly that JPY has been JPY has been dropping, dropping, dropping massively up to this point. So we go to this one. I was you can see the strong bullish. Uh, uh, a golfing pattern we have here. The strong bullish golfing pattern we have here, and you can see that the bulls are, are kind are trying to build from this base, right? So hopefully this this bullish momentum would continue. Hopefully, guys, in my mind, hopefully, but to open to continue at least up to this point, right? For the next couple of months, that JPY basket will be bullish, right? And the JPY but which is a JPY, they, that which more like the indicator for. For the JPYPS. So once this guy is bullish, you should know that JPYPS should be we'll, we'll be expecting that JPYPS should be bearish. Right? So th this guy is building up bullish, bullishly. So if you check it, look at it from the weekly time frame, you can see that okay, fine. You go to this point, it's kind of looking so much, it's looking like a strong range. Looking like we have a strong range around around about here, around, around about this point. It's like a strong range that price will need to will need to break from the weekly time frame. So JPY pair is on the strong JPY strength index, right? Or so the JPY basket, like we call it, that like it is being known as, is on a strong range. That is on a strong range that would need to be broken to be clear on the bullish momentum of the JPY basket. Right? It needs to break out of this range. To be clear on the bullish momentum of the paper, but at the moment the current momentum of the market is looking good for the bulls. So you can see from the month from the daily time frame, you can see how that we've been ranging around this zone. So we need a price we need to break a right, JPY basket. We need to break out of this zone to be sure that JPY PS are ready to bam bam and for us to chill with the big boys. You catch my flus. <laughs> so guys, right, uh JPYPS are not ready. Uh, JPY basket is not really it's not really, it's not exactly looking good, it's looking really dirty. So hopefully in the couple in the uh, in January, February or so in the couple of months, the market to be clearer. Right? Hopefully in the couple of months, market to be clear, clearer and be more precise on what direction to take. Hopefully we'll break out of this range. So for me, for before we I'll pay attention to anything around JPYPS. At least let's break out of this situation. This situation ship we are in right now. It needs to break out of this situation ship we are in right now. And this is why, because it's consolidating, it is not clear. 
It is why most JPY PS2 are not clear. They've just been consolidating also. So look at uh, the image. Let's show you something on JPP JPY. So you can see JPP JPY. Look at it from the monthly time frame. We've been trending, right? Looking at like, looking like we've been trending. But look at it from the weekly time frame, and you know that clearly that this market is crazy. Even if it's trending upward, it's really crazy. From the daily time frame, you will now see for yourself clearly that this guy is not just is not looking good at all on the daily time frame. So, so that's also I wonder how some of you have been trading this market. Like, ah, you guys, when I see is coming to say, ah, JBJPY buy, I'm seeing like, I'll be like, what? Just JBJPY sell. What are you buying and what are you selling? Know this then one minute traders and uh, five minutes time frame traders. What are you guys buying and selling? So this is like the market, guys. Look at this is the market. This is the market generally, and you can see how it is actually consolidating. It is so rough and crazy. This is the situation stage of the market right now. Ranging, 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 ranging. We are here. Hopefully to drop. Right? Hopefully that this guy will drop because the XY. I mean, sorry, hopefully because JPY basket is trending upwards. So this guy should be assuming this guy will drop from here. Hopefully, I think I will drop from here. So this, that this, this, this is that about GBB, JPY. You can see it's a strong consolidation. The market is not just set. It's not just looking good for any deal or any business. So one of the best ways to trade this market, guys, is trading the market with a clear structure. Ensuring that the structure is clear enough, clear enough for you. But this is the X Y from the moon. This is uh, let me clear this market. This is AUD JPY. AUD JPY from the months later from you can see how this guy has just been so crazy. So for a couple of months, you can look at the market, look at AUD JPY guys. For a couple for the couple of for the for the past months, this guy has just been ranging. For the past how many months now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine months. For the past nine months, AUD JPY has just been ranging. So what where, where are you seeing buy, sell? Then guys, where are you seeing buy and sell? Some of the weekly time we can see that you see looking like we are having a uh, a head and shoulders pattern. You can see it from the weekly time frame. Having a head and shoulders pattern. So this guy will need to break. At least we have we have this neckline to contend with that hopefully we'll break it before bleeding downwards. So if the market is not ready to bam bam, I will let it be let it break above this zone. But as far as I'm concerned, all that is going on around here between this level and this level is just consolidation. So I'm not interested in this market. Right, so you can see how exactly they trade this market and how exactly to, what exactly to look out for in this market to be profitable. So if you are not trading like this, I wonder how you've been trading and how you've been surviving the onslaught of the market, guys. I really, really wonder, I really fear for you guys how you've been surviving this market because I don't understand what a lot of you guys have been trading. Right? So you can see the market has not broken the neckline of this head and shoulders pattern. So it is still very much consolidating. You can see very strongly consolidating, very strongly consolidating. So this is just... Except you want to take advantage, maybe as it touches this point, you may be buying from here, fine. So some, some of you maybe have been following the consolidation, which is that is good for you, but I'm not it once the structure is not clear, it's not decent enough. Me, I'm not interested in it. So this is why I've hardly ever traded these peers. Because they have not been ready for a long time. So me too, for the you can see for the past nine months, ADJP has not been ready. Me too, I have I backed off from it. Because if this guy has not been ready for me too, I'm not ready to take it. So this is why, this is why in, in 2023, you must make up your mind. Right? To trade the best setups. Nothing less than the best setup. If the market is not ready, you too are not ready. Because enough of you gambling and gambling your money on setups that are, are, are not ready. Right? On food that is not ready. That is not ready. So when you eat food that is not ready, you know what all that happens, it will purge you. 
if you eat an if you eat an undone food, you definitely poach. So, so that's why you guys have been blaming your account because you guys have been eating unborn undone foods. Right? Packets that are not ready. Unripe, unripe, un, unripe. I think we said unripe food. Tastes like unripe food. <laughs> Oh, that market, I'm gonna have right, whatever because don't, just, don't, don't stress me. This this English, it's not, my, it's not my mother's tongue, so this as I have no business. If I either is quiet or not, that's not my business. I don't give a damn about English. So, guys, the next asset I want you to uh, we don't also, also to look at is uh, maybe maybe I think I've said a lot of persons looking at AUDJPY. So, AUDJPY, I'll be looking at this clearly for you guys from the monthly time frame. Let me clear all these stuff. It's been long I traded these guys, so that's why you can see them like this. Right? So don't blame me that Mr. Sources is not trying. Look at these charts. So because I don't trade them, I just sometimes I just analyze them and just forget about them. So maybe this is not necessary. This is not necessary. Okay, this is okay like this. So for the so this year you can see that AUDJP, USDJPY is looking from the monthly time frame. So you know, we have an inverse head and shoulders pattern, a very big one at that. You know me now. I have eyes, I can see. Whew. So we'll break maybe coming down to this one before shooting back up. So you can see that ADJPY has actually from the multi time frame, we are through the neckline of the a, of USD JPY, USD, USD JPY, USD JPY. This I'm saying AUD JPY, USD JPY, okay. This is like the neckline of USD JPY. As some of you would love to trade this asset, we have broken it, and this guy looks really nice and neat. So it's like the best uh, JPY pair. I think I'll start paying attention to it maybe from next year. So you can see that we have broken this neckline, and price is kind of more like coming back down to there. So if I don't go to the higher time frames, how would I know that there is a, an overall inverse than shoulders? Uh, that the neckline has been broken. You know, the, so this is what invest. This is what top institutions are seeing. Uh, you that is trading the lower time frames, one hour, thirty minutes, fifteen minutes. You are not seeing these things. This is what these guys are seeing. This is what this is how they are trading. This is what they are seeing. This is what they are looking at. This is how they are trading. Right. So you can see that this guy now we are the the net the natural strength of this guy is still bullish on USD JPY. So when the market is going to be dropping down, maybe dropping down before to this neckline before shooting, or maybe from here we shoot up. So for the now, I feel the market is still very much bleeding down. The USD JPY is bleeding down, at least to this neckline, All right? Before we can experience any rejection or anything. But if it breaks this guy. This is definitely the next target, right? You can see how to exactly and look at this few, few these assets, few these markets, and how to actually trade it profitably, guys. I'm showing you guys the best way to trade the market. I don't know what else I can give you guys for as Christmas gifts or New Year gifts than what I'm giving you guys right now, right? How you can trade this market from the from the place of ease, right? So this might not come. This is not this. This what I'm showing you guys is not for scalpers all day. People who are looking for quick money. It's for people who are patient to wait for the market to do as called and take advantage of the opportunities, bigger opportunities of the that the market presents. Right? Those who I'm a patient trader. Right? Those who are ready to look at trade the market from the bigger picture. Look at the bigger picture of the market and the which which also culminates culminates to the bigger amount of money. They stand to make in 2023. These are the kind of failures I'm talking to. Those who are patient to make big money in 2023 are the ones I'm referring to. So this is what for the couple of weeks we want to wait to see the market rest on these points. Then set nicely for a bullish ride for us to enter and ride it to the next to the next zone. Right? To ride it to the next zone. So definitely this will be my uh this will be my target. Right, so at least from here, from this point here to this point, that I want to trade this market. So you guys, from this point to this point, I want to trade this market. My system is trying to misbehave. It's tired. 
we have uh, over 2,439 pips to bank just on this guy. Not think about others. So you can see the, uh, the, the amazing opportunity that the market stands to present to us. So this is like the best asset or the best peer, peer on the JPY uh, set that I'll be looking at. Like this is like the best. This is like the best, right? So one of that guy maybe I will look at again is maybe uh, card JPY. Are you guys? It's also looking nice. Looking nice too, but okay. Let's let me let me clean all these lines I've drawn here. So I pride myself on having clean charts. I pride myself on having a clear market setup. So this is this is uh let me put this around here. Right, I pride myself on having clean charts, and uh, I think this will not be an exemption. An exemption, not an exception. What change are So this is uh card JPYP, you can see from the monthly time frame. Wow, this guy is also nicely set. We have a strong bearish reversal pattern, which is a bearish bearish Elgovin. You can see a strong bearish Elgovin pattern for the monthly time frame on card JPY. That these assets I'm calling are not the assets for trade traders. These are assets for long term to those who are ready to make the market in 2023. Those are the people I'm calling out this market this setups for. Not for scalpers and day traders. So you can see, Car JPY is another guy that is nicely set. Nicely set. When we had a strong money evening star, you can see how it broke down to this point. Right? So you can see we have a strong bearish uh, government market is already bleeding downwards on Car JPY. This is definitely bleeding down. So this is like a double bottom. This is like the neckline. So this, this is definitely the next target. In the few, in the couple of months, in the next at least January, February, March, this guy should be dropping up to this point. So if it breaks, it, then this will be the next target. So we hope from, from here we can shoot up. Or from here we bleed downwards. But this definitely nothing stopping it from getting into this zone. Nothing stopping it from getting into this zone. Nothing. You can see the free fall already from the monthly time frame. So you can see the momentum, the energy of the market is already bearish. So stop looking trying to look for buying or anything. Just position yourself accordingly and start selling. Weekly time frame has shown you a double top. After seeing a, a strong bearish recovery, weekly time frame is telling you that okay, we, we have a double top, and we can see that that double top, the neckline has been broken. This is like the neckline of the of the double top and it has been broken. Guys, I'm showing you these things so you can. I don't know what other Christmas gift or New Year gift you want me to give to you other than what I'm giving to you guys right now. So I'm begging you because I don't, I'm tired of people coming to me to say I have blown my account, I have lost money, I have lost. So I'm showing you guys the best guys things to trade and how you can make money from this market. I'm showing you guys opportunities from the market and how you can profit from the market. Right? So what this what this dude is doing right now, this is how you can trade it and make money. So for now, at least we know we are sure that you have uh almost a thousand pips to bank. So except if you're lucky that the market as it breaks goes to retest before bleeding downwards, fine. Right? Fine, fine, fine. That'll be fine for me. But then from the daily time frame, that's what the daily time frame is saying. So definitely this guy is, has been ranging for the past for some days now. So this zone might be is a very is very very important to me. This coming. I'm coming home. I want the world to know. I'm coming. I'm coming now. Other one. So this is like an important zone too that I want to reference in, on this on this asset. It's like more like an important zone I would want to reference on this asset. Uh, okay, okay. I don't know if this is best. This is okay like this. All right, this like because we need to break it. So breaking it will not give me that confidence to shut this guy. So you can see from the four-hour time frame, it's looking like we're having a situation ship, like a double bottom, and which might 
which might lead us to shooting this guy off to these parts to this zone hopefully hopefully before we play downwards but for the now market is still very much consolidating but this guy is just consolidating as far as the four hours time frame is concerned this guy is just consolidating and there is nothing you or me can do about it you get it you don't get it forget about it <laughs> get it you don't get it forget about it so this is what the market is doing right now and uh it's just consolidating that is catchable and forward time frame so day time frame will come tell time frame confirms that so we want to see guys this do the break above this zone this uh, consolidation not below it for us to be clear on what the market has to do in mind if it breaks below and um, at this one i said i might want to pay attention to <laughs> sorry sorry i think i've talked too much Talks too much. Uh, give me so let me take water. So, guys, this is my view on the market for 20. Uh, sorry, on card JPY. Don't mind me, guys. I'm really tired right now. <clears throat> my voice is already getting uh, cracked. So, this guy's really crazy, really, really, really crazy setup, right? I don't exactly trade this asset, but I think I would want to look at I might be interested in this dude uh, effects from. Uh, from 2023, I'm paying attention to this guy because this guy is, looks like it's nicely set, right? And those who've been able to catch it off from here, yeah, that's good money, man. That's good money. This guy, those who've been trading this guy have been catching out big time, so I will start paying attention to it, right? I'll start paying attention to it. So, the next thing I want us to look at is um, <coughs> gold, right? I think I know all these guys. So you got gold. What is gold saying? What is gold? Gold, 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 gold. Okay, what is gold saying? So guys, this is gold from the monthly time frame. Uh, let me clear my chart on gold because I'm trying to give you guys a very clear picture of the market. So I'm not compromising this for anything in the world. So we can see we had a double top situation and uh, we are, it is like the neckline of the market and we're supposed, we're expecting that, okay, this guy was gonna drop off. After this double top, we were building downwards. Nature. This is what we expect. But, but then we go to this point to the neckline and you can see that we can see this strong bullish candle this strong bullish engulfing this is like a strong bullish engulfing pattern the strong bullish engulfing pattern showing you that the buyers are really strong in this market the buyers are not joking right this is showing that the buyers are not joking at all buyers are not joking so for the, at least up to this this we're gonna be seeing gold buy up to this point, sorry, this 2k mark, right? Up to this over 2k mark. We're gonna be seeing gold trade riding up to this 2k because this is straight from the morning time frame. Market is it's already telling you this is what I want to do. This buyers I want buyers wants to want to ride. So every other thing you are seeing or saying doesn't concern the market, right? Market is strongly trying to ride strongly trying to ride right so if you go to the weekly time frame, we can see how the buyers are already pushing how they are kind of pushing hard already from the money time frame, this looks like from the weekly time frame, this now looks like an inverse head and shoulders right this looks like an inverse head and shoulders pattern that we might see that's happening soon which which might, might be enough a momentum for enough uh uh setup for the buyers to really rally price with this target to this target zone so you can add it from the daily time frame right if I get from the daily time frame we, we all cannot deny the fact that this is glaring and a very disturbing level zone in the market 
and that is clearly a very disturbing zone in the market that we'd want to pay attention to. So this is gold, right? So gold is currently on this major, on this significant zone, which I'm certain is going to break, right? I'm so certain it's going to break this and uh, continue rallying upwards. Right? It's going to rally, continue, it's going to break and continue rallying upwards. So this, you can see my projection on them on gold. We use something more. We set this up to be more. I'm trying to reduce this guy. Uh, okay, make it. I want to make it a little really small. I like this is okay. So this is gold. So this is my setup on gold. You can see that this guy is resting, resting on this zone. Right, this we like we here we here before and uh, we know we've seen what the market had done around this level. So a lot of consolidations, a lot of noise around this level. So now we are there again, and you can see the little fall is going on right now. But then I'm strongly bullish on gold, strongly bullish on gold. That's why what that's why where we are right now. I am still very much bullish on gold. I'm still very much, very very much bullish on gold, very much bullish on gold. Very much bullish on gold. So guys, this is my this is my this is my projection on gold as you can see, guys. But I, I feel I will need to go to break above this zone. At least have to give me the enough uh, confidence. Right, so let's use the word confidence now. Right, I'll be, let me see this zone and this zone. Let me see something. Yes, this I think this. I think it's supposed to be the next target actually. It's supposed to be the next target actually on gold. So uh personally, 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 personally. Personally, I uh, would want to right, I'd want to look at the market from this so I think this is more like I'm trying to map out that fifty percent. Another fifty percent mark I'm, I talked about before. I think it's like fifty percent. It's like fifty percent of the zone. So I think the market is going to get this. I want to map here as my very, very, very of my as my next projection on gold before this next major zone. And maybe I might use this green zone here because gold is looking really crazy, guys. It's looking really crazily say so let me just use this green map line here to map it out right so you can see we need to break above this zone for me to be satisfied on gold but then for now it's still rallying upwards right so it's still very much rallying upwards upwards so this is that about gold this is about gold let's look at btc now what is btc is saying btc from the monthly time frame because a lot a little of noise right what is BTC now seeing exactly? Right, what is BTC seeing? What really, 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 really is going on on BTC? What really is going on on BTC? So, guys, uh, this is BTC, and um, from the weekly time frame, for instance, look at okay, let me look at it from the monthly time frame. So, that's not some so that's not. There's almost nothing much to say about BTC from the monthly time frame, except that the market is still dropping. As you can see on the monthly time frame, the market is still very much dropping. That we are dropping down. Right. So you can see what the monthly time frame is showing us, giving us that higher time frame vibes. But hey, so let me do proper justice to BTC. So we know what we are expecting from this market, right? We know what we are expecting from this guy, from this dude. This is like the neckline, and uh, we have broken the neckline. We're going back down, down, down.
this is what you see from the monthly time frame so you can see this guy is just dropping down like staircase drop drop sideways drop sideways what next drop i say drop sideways drop sideways drop right drop so what what's next is drop <laughs> <laughs> Somebody sent me a message that is making me laugh. But I saw from the weekly time frame, it's not the, the, the same thing, right? So it, the money time frame has already shown us that okay, well, this guy's kind of trying or wanting to drop. Right? So from the weekly time frame, market is more like consolidating. Right? Other this consolidation that was a drop consolidation, so it wants to build up some consolidation again before drop. So the truth is, before we can see any major rise around on BTC, price definitely needs to come and sit down on this on this zone. I can see how this zone it is. Price needs to come and sit down on this zone first. When it, once it sits there, you can see on the weekly time frame. Then from there, you can, BTC will now know if it wants to pick up. That is the 10k mark, right? Price needs to come and sit down on the 10k mark before making any decision on whether to continue the ride or not. Right? Price needs to come and sit down on this 10k mark to be sure of what it wants to do next. Right, it needs to come and see this the market naked. You can see how it is, it is just dropping. Lower high, lower low, lower high, lower low, lower high, lower low, a little lower high before it will drop down. So you can see how the market has just been falling like a staircase. I said the market is just dropping like a staircase. So overall, guys, I'm gonna be looking at this. We're gonna be seeing the market drop, dropping massively, right? We're gonna be seeing the market dropping massively. So do not be in a hurry to want to buy or hold any asset yet on, on the crypto so because these guys is not ready, is not ready to bam bam yet. Right? Currently we are at the 17k mark. We can see we are seriously ranging, seriously, seriously. You can see those market is currently seriously ranging. Right, you can see how BTC is seriously ranging at the moment. So it's not the market you want to be involved in. So it's market you want to box. Right, first my son, that's what I'm saying right now. It's just it's just this market you want to box. Anytime it is free from this box, then we can now discuss business. So that's just the best thing you can do on BTC. Let it break out of this box. Either above or below, then you cannot tell yourself, okay, fine. I want to trade according to this direction anything outside this just forget about it just go and relax right go and take a cheap break go and relax guys right come relax right come relax so guys please stick around because i'll be i'll have some very important um, uh, um information i need to pass you guys on my next screen so don't go anywhere but then if you have not subscribed to this channel please 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 ensure to do that right away do that right now subscribe to this channel hello guys welcome back to my screen i trust you guys got so much value from my chart and you've seen all the amazing stuffs that i have cooked and i've set for you in the market and think and my biggest advice to you is clean accordingly guys i'm i've been in this game for a long time and i'm telling you for free that trade and call daily i trust me you'll be making that big money of your dreams all at the platter of gold if only you are patient enough to trade just like i've called and i've shown you to do right and also uh, i want to really really say a big thank you a big shout out to all my amazing followers subscribers sort of those of you who have been even those anonymous uh followers those who have been following my channel even watching my videos even sharing my videos with as many as they could a big thank you to you guys a big shout out to you guys and we do more next year guys we're doing more next year and also very importantly a big reminder that that so much i'll be quick i'm already cooking for you guys in 2023 there's so much i'm already cooking out for you guys and trust me you guys aren't ready for what is about to hit you guys on this channel so you 
my biggest uh, plea my plea to you guys is to ensure to please share this video this my link to my channel i'll be dropping out on the description section share this video share my channel the link to the channel let's get this channel to rock the thousands thousands of subscribers in 2023 we can't be play we can't keep playing this small because we know the quality of content we're giving out here we are we there are no jokes guys all the information we get here are paid for highly sorted and paid for information are what i give you out here for free but a lot of topics a lot of uh, individuals and institutions pay me heavily just for these projections you are getting it for free a lot of investments investment firms come call me to share just to review that my chart my chart with them and i'm doing that for you with for you for free so guys please help me to make this video go viral make this channel go viral because it's not getting the kind of accolade it deserves because it deserves more than what you're having right now right and also if you've not subscribed to my channel ensure please ensure to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification and give this video a thumbs up because i know that so much you already you already have stored up in your mind for next year already and also very importantly you know that if you know you actually need education where well, you need to be trained you need to be more proper education and more proper training with session with me why right? you need me to really really coach and train you on how to really really do this thing some of you are just watching my videos for the very first time please ensure to use the link from the description section and, and send your request for this forex mastery program just a one-time payment of 200 dollars and you have a lifetime access to the forex master pool and trust me the price might go up will be going up that might the price for the program will be going up next year later within the first quarter of next year the price for the forex master program or the crypto master program will be going up so you can't afford not to take part of it right now so for now that we are still in january sorry we are still in december sorry don't mind me now that we are still in december 2022 you can still have access it at just 200 dollars Trust me, the program is worth more than the fee I charge. It's way more than needed because I give that's that's a lot, a lot I do with my students that I can't share right here in public. They, they know for themselves a lot I cook out for them when they're almost on a daily basis on, on my on my close community. Right. So if you really want to make big money in 2023. If you are really serious about changing your, your your financial situation, you really want to be tired of bleeding your account over and over and again in the market, ensure you grab you a copy of the Forex Mastery Program, guys. I can't I can't emphasize this enough. Get you a copy of the Forex Mastery Program if you want to if you want to go deep into crypto, you want to really know all that you need to that you you are supposed to know about the crypto market and making money. From the crypto market, from trading, from and from uh, uh, portfolio management to auction analysis to tokenomics to uh, uh, trading, right? To a lot, a lot, a lot of more amazing um, uh, content I've been able to put together in the Forex Master Program. And I'm sorry, on the Crypto Master Program, please get these my two courses, just four hundred dollars, four hundred dollars to give you access to these two courses. And make that make that deliberate investment on yourself as my entry 2023 so that you know you enter 2023 you're entering it ready and set to take the world you're ready to take the take your finances into the next level in 2023 so guys stop playing small my point is stop playing small for some of you will be saying 40 dollars is too big trust me it is nothing my students know this for free that Forty dollars we invest in yourself for the, for the crypto master program and the forest master program is nothing compared to how much you're gonna be making using all the information I have for you in these courses, right? Because I gave you guys all my cheat codes, all my life, all my years of studies, and research, and all that information I've been I've been able to put together and give you a hack. To make the whole journey faster for you that's what i've been able to do in, the, in these programs and, and in these courses so you can't afford not to be a part of this big and amazing program so if you're not if you need to access it the link is down below from the description section again access this program guys Ask. i know why i'm emphasizing on this because my next day we end playing small if you, you can see from my chat we have a lot of money to make so you can if, if you want to be a partaker of this big money then show yeah, part of the family 
You need to be a part of the family for you to enjoy the benefits of the family. So, guys, I'll be seeing you guys same time. I think on the 8th of January, I'll be shooting another the first episode for 2023 on the Twitter series. Till then, I feel emotional right now, but then I think I'll be seeing you guys. Oh, I'll be dropping some more videos, but not nothing about my charts, nothing about the charts, because this is the last last video for the year 2023 on the Twitter's font series, right? What an amazing way to shut down for the year. I love you guys. So thank you guys for who have been following me diligently. Please share more of these videos, my videos with your people. Let's grow this channel together, right? So I'll be seeing you guys next year.